Hello and welcome to the number one horror podcast on places where you can find people having sex on the internet, getting off. I am your host, the patron saint of podcasting, the warden Matt Ritter, and I am here with my co-host, the Vanna White of Trivia, the Will Gray, purveyor of Rivet City Radio, host of Botch Bots and Chair Shots, official scorekeeper, and uh, soon to be the man who's going to put his meat in my mouth come my birthday on Friday or Saturday. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> you heard that right, Reek. Don't act shocked. <laughs> He's a chef by trade and a mark by choice, and I am going to sample the sh- the delicious barbecue that Will has to offer. I don't understand what's wrong with what I just said. The show Bro, is we good. half a minute off the intro. Are you wilding <laughs> <Literally>. already? <laughs> don't act like you've never been here before. Uh, uh, our lovely contestants for Trick or Trivia. She is host of the She Leaves Showcase, Inside the Mind of, In the Crowd, Getting Off. And story time with Miss Katie Kinsey Bay Bay. Hey, hey. He is the uh, one of the four members of the core four, one of the three members of Young Kings Wrestling. He is host of the Havoc Hour. He is Dr. Reek Baker, B, B, C. <laughs> Every time. What up? And uh, he's muted. I don't know. Who, is it is it Tommy? Is it Timmy? Or is it Hector doing the show today? Uh-oh. Either one. They're all here today. We're, we're gonna go with Tommy. It's Tommy. Can we get some you know, elaboration on that? So generally, Hector wears a <laughs> cowboy hat, and since there's no cowboy hat, I'm assume despite what his nameplate says, he's not. It, it's not there. Uh Depending on if he just answers everything as Asia, it might be Timmy. But we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna hope for Tommy and see how it goes. You never know. Okay. Okay. All right. That's All right. So, <clears throat> ladies and gentlemen, this is trick or trivia, uh, and this is how this is gonna go. We have a slew of categories on a beautiful wheel that I will pull up right now, so you can see that. Uh, wheel. It's small, but you'll see it when it comes up. So the, uh, I guess okay. I can make it a little bigger here. Let me let, let me do that for you real quick. This is live TV, folks. Like we're all over thirty. This is not friendly to anyone's <laughs> eyes. Oh, Excuse I'm you? sorry. I'm sorry, ma'am. You're 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 the baby. My bad. I am. Um, I turned twenty eight this year. Thank you. Yeah. In respect. I'm just saying. I'm not 30 yet. So the categories are all things Freddy, totally. horror or yeah. porn, which is I will be giving you a movie title and you will tell me if it is a porno or a horror movie. Oh, uh, okay. Name that scene, uh, at which point I pull up a picture and then you tell me what movie it is from. And you are going to have to be specific to what movie in the franchise. You can't just give me a franchise. You have to give me the movie. Um, random horror trivia. Do this so you guys can see these. I have a slew of horror trivia cards here. I will pick a random card and give you that. Oh, that's crazy. <clears throat> and chat's choice. So whoever is in the chat will get to pick should you roll chat's choice. <laughs> Any I'm questions? Scared. I'm scared for that chat's choice. Like, I'm scared. For I don't know. Everything. I don't know what they know. <laughs> well, are we allowed yeah. to phone a friend? No, you are not. No. <laughs> I mean, have I mean, you ever been allowed to phone a friend. a friend? If I'm allowed to phone a friend, I'm phoning Matt because he's right here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can we can we phone Matt? Is that allowed? Um, I so except for horror or porn, I also will allow steals, uh, because obviously if it's horror or porn and someone's wrong, then it's the other one, so you can't steal that. We're not that's not going to be a thing. So uh, you can't steal from multiple choice if there's only two options. Yes, Tommy. So originally it's supposed to be like an elimination thing. Are we just gonna? Not do the elimination. Thing. We're not going to do the elimination. If if I had four contestants, we would have done uh, three rounds, and somebody got eliminated each round. Uh, because we have three contestants, we're not going to do elimination this time. I, Thank Justin for not being available tonight because you would have been gone first round, according to yourself, Tommy. I mean, yes. that's that's on brand, you know. Yeah. <laughs> what? 
I want to thank everyone for joining us, whether you're joining us at twitch.tv slash creation world, where if you have an Amazon Prime subscription, you have Prime Gaming. If you have Prime Gaming, you have a free subscription on Twitch once you link those two accounts. And you can give it to us. You can give it to us. You can give it to me. Please give it to me. But if not me, give it to Will. If, if you don't want to give it to Rivet City Radio and all the amazing shit that they have, give it to Katie because she's been accepting subs since 05. Like, no. <laughs> a long time. Weren't you in high school? In 2005? I graduated high school in 05. No. <laughs> uh, oh, no. No, no. You was definitely <laughs> below. <laughs> I'm you not even realizing how long now. At youtube.com slash creation world. And if you watch there, it is free to like, to subscribe, to comment. Vano, what does that do? It boosts the algorithm and it helps find new listeners. Yes, it does. And Katie, why is that important to me? Because you're a whore. That is correct, ladies and gentlemen. I am a whore. For your likes, for your comments, for your views, for your subscriptions, for your motherfucking attention. So what I need you to do is share this show. Share it with your friends. Share it with your sisters, your cousins, your aunts, your uncles. If you enjoy me, share it with anyone else you think might like this and might get a laugh, get some enjoyment, or learn something from the show. Spread us around as much as possible. Spread me like the whore that I am. And while you're doing that, flick that bean, hit that notification bell up top, get notified every time we go live, whether it is Friday at noon for the Creation Conversation, Saturdays at 10 p.m. Central now, 11 p.m. Eastern for Smacking It Raw, or every other Sunday, including this this Sunday, right now, this Easter, right now, for getting mm -hmm. off. Also, going forward, 10 p.m. Central, 11 p.m. Eastern. Yay. <sighs> and with all of that said... I got a quick question before we start. Um, yes. When when did Will become Vanna White? When he offered to be the scorekeeper and be my Vanna White, because uh, Katie was uh, doing the trivia. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. He literally, literally <laughs> said, I'll be your Vanna White. I do this on okay. Thursdays for Boss Bitch Trivia for Al. I spin the wheel and keep score and put categories together. So when Matt said he was interested in doing trivia, I was like, I'll give you that, the reach around, like I do for Al every week. And I helped him set up the wheel and get it. Like, I was, I, I gave him the brotherly love I would give out. Just yeah. got your I, I, was, I, I was assuming the correlation. I just wanted to make sure I was on the right page, but. All right, cool. I do, I do love how everyone was talking about how much older I am than them in the chat. They're all like, I was in seventh grade. I'm like, I graduated high school. I think Will said he was a sophomore in college. In no, because, well, yeah. listen, Will was at the first WrestleMania. We talked about this all the time. He was the cameraman. Uh-huh. <laughs> in 05, I was already in a fraternity. Holy fuck. Damn. <laughs> Just to put it in perspective. I was in the sixth grade, bro. Uh -huh. All right. <clears throat> we are just going to go in order of uh, the screen. We are going to start with Katie and then go Reek and then go Tommy. Oh, so, okay. No, I'm Katie. Scared. No, I'm scared. I don't want to go. Fuck. Listen for the claps. You ready? In that movie, oh boy! All right, oh, okay. that movie. I'm not gonna do well. We're gonna do this one. I, I don't want to do this anymore. Can I leave? <laughs> nope. No, you can't. Fuck. <laughs> okay. Oh, we get clips. What in the actual fuck is that? That's from the office. That's obviously Dwight. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it is though. I'm really confused. Ew. Uh, what? Ew. Damn. Ew, I actually no, don't know. Hot. It's actually making me nauseous. <laughs> is that fish scale he got on his bottom half of his body? God damn. In what world do you think I know what the fuck this is? I, I honestly know that you have seen this movie. I know all three of you have seen this movie. No. Well, maybe not Tommy. Stop playing. I've seen this movie. How certain are you I've seen this movie? Very certain. Oh, like, shit. like, 
like we've covered it on these airwaves Reek, before? We have not covered it on the airwaves. Reek, I know you've seen this movie for a fact. So we haven't covered I it. I could be wrong about Katie. I guarantee Reek has seen this movie. Yeah, so don't make assumptions because I don't fucking... <clears throat> I... I uh, I'm, I'm, I'm need I don't. I don't know. I don't know. No, I don't. You got no it, guess. It, no, anyone I don't wanna, fucking. Anyone want to no. try? Uh, <laughs> House of a Thousand Corpses. One point for Reek. No, no stop I haven't seen that. <laughs> House of a Thousand Corpses. <laughs> That's the only guess I would have had. <laughs> no, I've when never turn, actually seen that. Otis turns Dwight into the fish boy. That's why he looked familiar. Okay. All right. No. See? Fuck. Damn it. So I hate this game. Point. Rick got that point. I hate this game. Hey, the chat did not get the point. Vince guessed Saw. <laughs> Vince. No. <laughs> if it was Saw, I know office. Saw. I know Saw. Hola, mi amor. Como estas, papi? <clears throat> All right, Rick. Oh, boy. Damn it. Let's go, Rick. Yeah, Rick. I told you Reek was going to win. Nobody believed me. Again. Not the same one. Oh, boy. <laughs> Good. Okay. No, you're going to know it. So it doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> All hey, right. I, I wasn't I wasn't so sure I was going to know this one, but I don't know hey, if he's going to know it. this one, Katie. Well, don't say that, because then I want to steal it. Oh, damn. What's crazy is I feel like I do know this, but... Wait, which one is uh, it? Uh, damn. Damn, damn, damn. Um... This is ringing so many bells, but it just, it's, not, it's not coming to me right now. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, oh. Wait, is it coming? Okay, I think I think it, I think it is. I think it is. I think it is. I don't. All right, you got me. I'm I'm, I'm stumped on this one. Me, me, me. All right, Katie. Is it Leprechaun Three? It is Leprechaun Three. Yes. And Katie's on the board. How you doing over there, Tommy? <laughs> Good, just fine. Oh, he looks stressed right now. Right. <laughs> well, Tommy, it is your turn. Uh, Hopefully, uh, the weight on this isn't all fucked up and it doesn't do that again. Oh, it removed name that movie yeah. for some reason. Well, uh oh. <laughs> now, now that's not an option, so it is still an option. <coughs> oh, darn. Oh, man. Yeah, it's not going away. It's not that easy. <laughs> all right, chat. What do you want Tommy to get? All things Freddy, random horror trivia, name that movie, or horror or porn. I think I know what Tommy's hoping for. <laughs> <laughs> chat got a point, too. Chat did get a point. Allison knows. That's my Allison goal. said horror or porn. <laughs> the porn one. <laughs> the porn. Bridget doesn't like these categories. That's not my problem, Bridget. <laughs> God damn. Wow. He said, that is not my problem. <laughs> I think it just has to be the porn one. Uh, it's going to be the porn one. All right, Tommy, I'm going to give you the name of a movie, and you were going to tell me if it is a horror movie or a porn movie. <sighs> Hellspittle. What? Hellspittle? Hellspittle. <laughs> I'm going to the porn, sir. That is correct, Tommy. <laughs> Tommy's on the board. And, like, you think, like, the, the, like, hospital, spittle, and hell? Yep. And that's that's definitely skirting the line. <laughs> I, I believe spit, much like our show with our spits and swallows, was capitalized in the title as well. Ah, uh, okay. So, uh, I think we're gonna go one more round, and 
everyone's going to go one more time, and that'll end round one, and then we'll move on to round two. Everybody's got a point, including the chat. <laughs> All right, Reeks Katie. stole Katie's. Katie stole Reeks, and then Tommy got his <laughs> right. <laughs> All things Freddy. I have a chance. Okay. So yeah, all right. Don't take this is <laughs> this is actually multiple choice. Okay. Which character in the third of the series? So uh, the third movie in the series sleepwalks to their death your options are nancy Kristen, joey or philip it's not nancy obviously it's are you do you want to answer will no i'm just kidding okay <laughs> i think i know the answer though is it christian uh Kristen. Joey, oh, whatever. Nancy, or Philip. Nah. Oh, you're, you're well Kristen? then, no, 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 no. I thought you said Christian. No, Christian. Then I'm going with then I'm going with Philip. Philip is the correct answer. That was my guess. I thought you said Christian. I can't hear. Hey, Katie gets a point. I'm like, it's either All right, Reek. If it was Joey or Philip, remember what no, name Joey, I was screaming Joey at him. Joey was the one who didn't talk. Ah, uh, yeah. Makes sense. <laughs> Horror porn. Just so you know, this is my favorite category. Oh, I know no, it is. <laughs> Nobody is surprised by that statement. Deathgasm. That's definitely a porno. That is incorrect. It's a horror movie. What? Deathgasm is a horror movie. I've wow. seen that name in like a what horror the? thing before. Ah, you got tricked. Oh, that's crazy. Gotcha. Terrible Ready, name. Tommy? Oh, man. You're one for one right now, bro. You're doing good. Matt Timmy, Metallica. you got this. <coughs> what do we got? What do we got? Name that movie. Go ahead and assume he's not gonna get. <laughs> wow, that's whoa, great. No whoa, faith. whoa, whoa, whoa! No faith in Hector. That's I got one. one for Tommy. All right. Mm -hmm. It's also crazy. He's not even going in like an order. He's just picking for fun. Yeah, yeah. that's cool. Oh, um, that's easy. Yeah, <laughs> me really like we know it. It's too easy. That is almost too easy. Uh, would that be Final Destination? Which one? Oh, fuck. Three. <laughs> Incorrect. I'm stealing. I'm stealing. Okay. Reek, do I have it? Do I have it? It's two. You do? Final Destination two is correct. Is that what we have to do when I raise hand? I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> Whoever shouts it out first. All right. I, I both, I just... You both said that's too easy at the same time, but neither of you really raised the hand. Oh, well, I didn't. I yeah. didn't know how we were doing. I just, That's I fine. just be quick on the trigger because I played a lot of trivia in my day. So, yeah. Why is Vince just guessing Saw? Because week? Saw is the new Asia. For trigger trivia, <laughs> the answer is always Saw. The same way on Boss Bitch trivia, the answer is always Asia. <laughs> Are we on? Also, Saw is the only horror movie Gosh. he's ever watched. This is true. Is this round? That's two? This is the. This is round two. Okay. okay. Two, two, one, one. Chat's choice. Chat, what are we giving Katie? No. Everything Freddy's my vote. We'll vote <laughs> everything Freddy. Will I vote? Vince, Allison. Take Vince it. votes Matt. No, <laughs> I don't think that's... We um, haven't had a random horror trivia yet. Corner horror from Vince, so that's one for that and one for Freddy. Oh, excuse me. Allison, Bridget. Anybody else watching? What do you got? Allison said more. Allison. All right. All right, Katie. Uh -oh. <clears throat> Nightmare Sisters. See, I don't like this game. <laughs> <laughs> Bridget also said porn. She said I heard my name. Porn. 
horror. That is correct. Well played. Okay. That puts you in the lead, Katie. Hell right. yeah. It's not going to be long, but I'll hold it while I can. <laughs> All right. Reek. Stay right there. Stay right there. Stay right there. Oh, my God. <laughs> there we go. Spoken into existence. Random trivia card. I'm just going to pull it right <laughs> off the top. Oh, shit. And your question is, uh, which four prophetic spirits from the Bible may be considered harbingers of doom or victory, depending on your point of view? What? <laughs> I think I know this. Uh, may be considered harbingers of doom for prophetic spirits from the Bible may be considered harbingers of doom or victory depending on your point of view <laughs> well knows. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah, I'm passing on that one. <laughs> Katie? Is it the, the, I don't know, like the correct phrasing is like the four, is it the, the horsemen of the apocalypse? The four horsemen of the apocalypse is correct. Good job, Tommy's Katie. in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> what does prophetic mean? Tommy. <laughs> I didn't realize that was Tommy. <laughs> oh, man. Whew. Four Horsemen of the Apocalypse is correct. And another point for Katie. All right. Useless knowledge. That's all that's yeah, up she here. Killed, she killed no, us right Nothing, nothing of value is in this brain. Nothing. You feeling confident, Tommy? Oh, confident I'm ever going to get. <laughs> Katie's that's four, the Reek is two, Tommy's one, Chad is two. Bridget quits. <laughs> You know, that whole confidence level just went down immediately. <laughs> All things Freddy. All right, Tommy. <sighs> How did... Oh, no, see, that... Mm, hold on. <laughs> How did this guy die? A glove with knives on it? <laughs> uh, what is E? That's always All the above. <laughs> What was the name of the last surviving teenager in Springwood? You could guess any name <laughs> if you don't know. Any name. Well, we're just going to take a stab at this one uh, and say uh, Joey. You were actually fairly close. Anyone else want to take a guess? Reek? I'm just going to say Nancy in whatever continuity. Incorrect, Katie. You want to take a stab? Well, if Joey was close, um, no, wait, is it Kristen? That is incorrect. No, Katie it's last, the other bitch. Who's the daughter? Who's the daughter? She was not a teenager, she was an adult. The last surviving teenager in Springwood, you have the right movie, Reek, is John Doe, the boy <laughs> that he used <laughs> to get to his daughter. Oh in Freddy's God. Dead. Yeah. I forgot what his name is completely. <sighs> Shit. All Damn. right. Clear. Don't want to remove. How you feeling, Katie? Mm, I'm a little less confident now. All right, let's see. <laughs> Good job, Will. This one's appropriate. What the fuck does that mean? Oh, boy. I don't like the way he says that. That means it's terribly inappropriate, probably. <laughs> well, just, just, for the, uh, just for the fan base here, I feel like this one is appropriate. Oh no! It's gonna. I'm not gonna know. It's gonna be like a part of a franchise. I'm not gonna know which fucking one, and I'm gonna be mad. <sighs> oh, come on now, come on now. No, stop, stop! You can't oh. do that. 
I'm raising my hand immediately. No. Which one is that though? See, I knew this shit was gonna hurt. Um, okay. Let me think. Let me think. Oh my god, which one is it? Um In case no, uh, you're watching and you can't it see it, there's a young lady wearing only a t-shirt that says cops do it by the book holding a basket of candy. No, wait. Which one is it, though? I can't remember the subtitle. You can just give me the, the, the number. I will accept that as long as you get the right number. Halloween 4. Damn. That is correct. Is that the curse? No, that's not the curse with Michael Myers. That's six. Return. Yeah, I'm not good with the subtitles Damn. on the Halloween movies. Ye of curse. little faith. See, I <laughs> thought you just didn't know which one it was at all. So I was I, I knew it was hot tag. <laughs> oh, sorry. I knew it, but like I was the, the fucking subtitles. Tommy every said time. nice legs though. He's just <laughs> <laughs> existing in the chat. Tommy's just Tommy. hanging out. <laughs> it's okay, you got I, I got more points than I expected, so I'm, all, I'm here. You're My home oh got God. one point, dog. Okay, we go back to trivia. <laughs> Woo. I'll do it for Will since he's taking a hit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, I, I, I'll actually... I'll actually accept multiple answers for this one, Reek, but uh, what is the modern name for the ancient Egyptian funerary text which contains spells intended to assist a dead person's journey through the underworld? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I would have done better tonight than I thought. Uh, <laughs> what is the modern yeah. name for the ancient Egyptian funerary text? So funeral text. Uh, mm -hmm. Which contained spells intended to assist a dead person's journey through the underworld. Uh, I'm not trying to be funny, but you can appreciate the answer I'm going to give to Necronomicon. I will accept that because Necronomicon <laughs> translates to the Book of the Dead. Yep, which is the correct answer. Okay, cool. Yeah, I would have said that. Be my guess too. Oh, okay. I, it was probably written in hieroglyphics, Tom. Probably. So not He's wrong. Not really Never, Necronomicon was 100% going to be my guess. Yeah, that, that's, that's all I got. It's the only and thing see, I know. I figured, knowing you guys, I figured that's what you guys would have gone with, which is why I said, I said I'd said i accept yeah. multiple answers. Alan said, is it that thingy you talk about, the Necronomicon or whatever? Yes. Yes, <laughs> that, that's the one. <laughs> that's the oh, one. Oh, Tommy. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, Timmy, you yeah. got this, bud. <laughs> I love that, like, the thing blocks Will and Matt, but I can still see right. them going crazy when that spin happens. So, I'm letting you guys know right now, neither yeah. of you are allowed to steal this one. Oh. Okay. Tommy, I need you to finish the sentence. <laughs> one, two, Freddy's. Oh, come for you. One point for Tommy. Woo! I win! Smartest man alive! Oh, okay, thank you. You must not have had faith in him on this one. <laughs> there was another one that was really easy that I wouldn't let you guys steal, but honestly, I wasn't sure if he knew the answer to that one. So, mm. And I'm not going to wow. use it for this game, so I'll tell you it's who played Freddy Krueger. Actually, Tommy, if you can tell me who played Freddy Krueger, I'll give you a bonus point. I don't remember his name. I can I can tell you his face, but I can't remember his fucking Which, name. Okay. See, I wasn't. That's why I wasn't so, sure. But see, trick okay. question because which nightmare movie? How dare you? There's only one Freddy. <laughs> that other one doesn't count. That guy. I, that guy's it's, name. It's, I don't even it's know. A fair, it's a fair question. Who is I know, Robert England? Did How you just Google that, Tommy? <laughs> no, I swear to God. <laughs> He's the new Phil. <laughs> <laughs> I I did say I would give you a bonus point if you got it right and you got it right, so we can give. How did he Tommy just pull Robert point. England out of his ass though? I'm real, I'm real suspicious. I'm though. I'm literally my 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 hands right here and my hands on my vape. <laughs> okay. I mean, of of all the things you can pull out of your ass, Robert England isn't the worst. 
<laughs> think about the glove. Think about the glove. Yeah. Um, like that right hand. We're going to do, because this is actually going a lot faster. Um, so I, I don't think we're really just going to go in rounds. I think we're just going to keep going around okay. and uh, racking up points. And then, uh, yeah, because I didn't realize how fast all of these were going to go and only two rounds. Like you guys That's burned okay. through them so quick. So, no, no, no. That's fine. Uh, I mean, Will, you can oh. separate them into rounds if you want, but we're just, we're not just going to do three rounds. We're just going to keep going because uh, I've just been tallying a total score for everybody. I wasn't sure Perfect. if we were going to do the rounds or not. <laughs> so that works. Katie's five, Reek's three, Tommy's three, Chad's two. And Katie. Back okay. Up, ready. <laughs> that's a that's like the the favorite today okay okay what type of natural disasters happen frequently in the movies what the fuck <laughs> what type of natural disasters See, Here, like let me let me rephrase that because that they have it phrased poorly. What type of natural disaster happens frequently in a new nightmare? Um, earthquakes. That is correct. <laughs> Surviving, but. <laughs> I'm a survivor, I baby. I was <laughs> naming like natural disasters. What was what, what would have been the first one you were gonna name, Tommy? My first one was like earthquakes, twisters, tsunamis, fucking hurricanes. <laughs> so yeah, any one this. of you would have got that right at this point. So hey, that's not bad. All right. I have a skin in my fucking teeth. And Reek is up. Let's see how that PhD comes in handy there, Reek. <laughs> <laughs> Um, well, it just looks like a Muppet right down there when that happens. Reek. All right, Reek. compliment because <laughs> I just watch you in the corner. <laughs> You're on the top row. All right, Reek, I got it for you. No, that's not what I want. I clicked on the wrong thing. Don't get me one too crazy. Give him a crazy one. Oh, oh House of Wax. Fuck. One point for Reek. One point uh, for Reek. Way to go, Reek. Because Paris Hilton and her titties. That's not fair. That's all, that's all you needed to know. <laughs> that's all you needed to know. <laughs> that's, why, that's why majority of the people went to go see that movie. You see Paris Hilton boobs, you go, House of Wax. Wax. Why say? <laughs> all right. Tommy? Uh, what are you hey, hoping this, for, Tommy? This is fun. Uh, not that one. <laughs> <laughs> I think he was probably All hoping right. for the one that was right next to it. <laughs> Let's see. What 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 can I give Tommy? Bro, just give me anything. I'm just gonna name something random anyways. All right, so I'm gonna let you guys know now. I'm going to be watching you two. First one to raise their hand is going to get this. Oh, shit. Not Will. <laughs> Put your hand out on your chain already. <laughs> Katie was first. Well, Tommy is the guest first. <laughs> no, I know. <laughs> Tommy, I believe in you, buddy. Come on. <laughs> You got this, Tommy. Let's go, Tommy. Is it Scream? It is Scream! I want to say, you got to get this. She's she killing us right now. <laughs> Let's go, Tommy. Yeah, Tommy. Yeah, Tommy. Matthew See, Lillard, that's you're doing right way there. better than you thought you would. I think you're doing better on my trivia than you boss bitch trivia. Mateo. <laughs> yes? Asia. Are you drinking a Coke? Uh, yes, I was, but I also have a Dr. Pepper here. No, 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 no. This right here? 
We're like on the same cycle. Ah, oh, you see, guys are minor, both Tony Khan. That's crazy. <laughs> and we got the DP. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh huh. All right. I just have Mountain Dew. Well, what kind of Mountain Dew is that? Dangerous. Science. It's Tony Khan. There's no booger sugar on this channel. <laughs> there was Coke. <laughs> <laughs> no, fuck. All right. <clears throat> Beyond fucked a zombie odyssey. <laughs> Ow, <sweet. laughs> I, it, I feel like it has to be porn, but no, I'm, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say horror. You're gonna say horror? Yeah. Incorrect. Eh, whatever. I don't There's think it'd be no that way. easy. There's no way that title was a, a horror movie. <laughs> <laughs> actually, there's actually a very good chance a lot of the stuff that's on here are like C and B level horror exactly. movies. And beyond fucked, a zombie odyssey is definitely something you could get in like a B level horror movie. As a that's title. what I'm saying. Like, it doesn't have to be know. like top. Zombies tier. versus strippers is not a porno, it's a horror movie. Like, exactly. It's fair game. I gotta watch that one. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> oh. all right. It's all right. I get questions wrong. It happens. What are you hoping for, Reek? Uh, throw that. Yeah. That right there. <laughs> he said that one works. That's the one I'm leaning on. All right. How did Amanda Kruger become Freddie's mother? Oh. Uh, try and be as safe with your answer as possible. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's why, that's why I was thinking. Okay, so she was in a, I guess, a prison, and she was violently assaulted by, I don't remember how many men. I'm going to need the say... answer of how many men. What? In the title, it specifically says how many men. <laughs> and if you remember, when this was introduced, his nickname was the son of. Uh, was it 100? 100. I don't know, bastards. <laughs> uh, Katie, you want to take a guess? Oh. Um. Oh, oh shit. Man. Oh, see, I, I, it's on like the tip of my tongue, but I don't know it. It's gonna bother. It's gonna be make me really fucking mad when you say it. <laughs> I don't have a guess. Tommy, you want to take a guess of what the last word and what Reeks said? A hundred what? Oh wait, I think I know it. <laughs> uh, no, go ahead. One hundred maniacs. I. <laughs> The son of 100 maniacs. I literally, when you asked Tommy, my brain was like, oh, maniacs? Knock all this shit over. Wow. That's terrible. You know what, though? We are going to give Reek that point because the question technically was, how did she become his mother? And he stated the events he said what that happened. occurred. Even though it wasn't, I, I, I'm gonna give Reek that. I'm not gonna be a dick. <laughs> Hundred bastards is. I kept it. I kept it PG. You did. Well done. It's the only PG thing on this show, so. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I mean, I started six, the show saying I was gonna five. put. Tommy has four. All right, chat. What are we giving Tommy? What if we just. Oh, I was going to say, what if we just let Will decide as he types in the chat? <laughs> Will says porn. <laughs> just give him a porn one. I'm going to give general it... trivia. One of those two. That would be my other one. Five. Ooh. Four. Random. Three. Oh, okay. Random. So we got random one trivia. of each. Tommy, I'm going to let you pick. Do you want horror porn or random trivia? Hey, give me a trivia card. All right. 
Tommy. Hmm. <laughs> uh, I, 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 wrong choice. <laughs> <laughs> Which actor plays the role of the main vampire, Louis de Pont du Lac, in Interview with a Vampire? I don't know. You want to just guess an actor? Is it is it a famous actor? Yes. Brad Pitt. Holy shit, Tommy. <laughs> He's like an idiot savant. He's like a fucking rain man. <laughs> the, cr the crowd was too stunned to speak. I, I know Whoa. I butchered his name because I don't do French, but yeah, no, hey, it's Brad Pitt. My next Whoa. guess was Tom Cruise. Mine too, honestly. Tom Cruise was my guess. <laughs> Those yeah, like, the main vampires in those movies, so you were. Close, I didn't even know if he was in that. Tom movie. Cruise, I believe, was Lestat. He was sure, Lestat. of course. Yeah. Yeah, I got their roles mixed up because <laughs> I just the look on all of our faces simultaneously. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. So far, Tommy all. has pulled Robert England and Brad Pitt out of his ass. But I'm just like, I'm just sitting there watching. I'm like, yo, what if he Loki gets the answer dead on? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, Katie. Oh, he's got uh -huh. I'm not gonna know him. What is the difference between a graveyard and a cemetery? <sighs> mm. Mm. Um, feels like I know the answer. I don't think I don't know the answer. See, I don't know which one is which. One of them's like next to a church, which but one? I, I know that's my problem. Um, cemetery. Incorrect. Fuck. Uh, Tommy, the, she already said yeah one of them is at a church and i'm said yeah. which one yeah. uh chat does get a point allison was correct a graveyard is always adjacent to and part of a church well played Katie i hate six, this Reed game has five tommy has five chat has three wait what's the scores six five five and three katie's still winning yeah by one there's been a slow truck. comeback. At one, at one point, Katie had six and everybody else had three. And then Reek and Tommy have both went on a, a tear. Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. And Katie can't answer. Oh, my question. goodness. These trivia cards. All right. I mean, honestly, this was going to be the whole game. And then I decided to actually do categories and not just read you guys trivia. So um, I, th cool. I think you got this the one, though, Reek. Uh, in the Middle Ages, what substance was considered so powerful that churches had it? had to keep it under locked covers to prevent uh, its theft for use in witchcraft. What? In the Middle Ages, in the Middle Ages, not agents, in the Middle, in the Middle Ages. Ages, what substance was considered so powerful that churches had to keep it under locked covers to prevent its theft for use in witchcraft? Uh, that's not my answer. <laughs> it's, shit. it's shit. It's literal shit. <laughs> oh, I mean, to be fair, it would be holy shit if we. Well, but... fair. My apologies. Yes, holy shit. Still not my answer. <laughs> oh. Huh. Damn, that's uh, I'm gonna need an answer, Reek. Uh, mm. <laughs> yeah, I got nothing. 
<laughs> that, that, that one stunk me. Katie? Yeah. Is it the blood of Christ? That is incorrect. Tommy, Shit. you want to take a stab at this? I had a second guess, but that sounded more right. You don't you don't want to say no? Okay. The answer is holy water. <laughs> that was my second guess. <laughs> oh, water. Oh my goodness. I was gonna say that first, but blood of Christ sounded more demonic. Damn it. See, this game sucks. <laughs> uh. Tommy gets horror porn. All right, Tommy. <clears throat> Midnight Meat Train. <laughs> Ew. I'm going to go out and let me say horror film. That is correct. That I don't because that 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 wouldn't fool anybody there. Midnight Meat Train, uh, something that I think I might call our post shows, is absolutely <laughs> no a horror film. Can I veto that? That's, that's, about, to, that's about to be a post yeah. show. Post show is officially the Midnight Meat Train because like, the show ends around midnight. It's my time. Well, that too. It just makes sense. Might as well tell Travis right, already. You ready? No. I'm on a losing streak. All right, chat. What do you want to give Katie? All things horror or all things Freddy? Horror porn? Random trivia? Or name that scene? Porn. We'll say Will porn. chooses poor. <laughs> And then and Tommy, Tom, Tommy said random. I think that's just Tommy's just chilling in the chat. <laughs> Tommy is the chat. Tommy is the chat. <laughs> Tommy has somehow became trick or trivia without even, he just stumbled into the role. <laughs> <laughs> and Allison said, name that scene. So I'm, ju I'm just going to pick. All right. Um, We're going to do name that scene. No. <laughs> All right. Wait. Oh. Oh. Put, put your hand down. Stop it. <laughs> Oh, I know it, but do I? That's a good one. You should. Can I ask a question? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, I'm sorry. No, what? that's not fair. You absolutely can ask a question. Yes, you can. You're not going to answer me. That's neither here nor there. You're allowed to ask. No, well, then, no. Fuck you. You're not going to answer me. Listen, then. You're not an asshole. <laughs> Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Okay. Uh, the can you... new one from 2019 or whatever. Yes, I'll give you that. <laughs> it's not from 2019! <laughs> I said or whatever. It's the newest one. It's like I know 21. what she meant. I, I was hoping she'd say Netflix. I would have given her that too. Oh yeah, that that is the one from Netflix. I also, hey, Reek, I didn't make you say maniacs, and I gave you your point. Okay, all right, fair, fair enough, fair enough. Yeah, why are you trying to fight me right now? And I, nah. gave, I gave Tommy a bonus point for pulling Robert England out of his ass like a rabbit out of a hat. Yeah. See, you you, 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 you feigning like you don't like you don't know the answers, and then you just pop it out of nowhere. I see. Uh, well, I see I'm on to you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, take it easy. Um, no, well, it's the it's the sub. Title shit. I don't know. That's why I hesitated. Oh, all that's all things Freddy. Freddy. That's Freddy. Oh, 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 oh. All things Freddy. Oh man. All right. All right, Reek. This, this this one might be a little tough, but it's multiple choice. Okay. Uh, in which of the nightmare movies from the list below 
did producer Robert Shea not appear? Ooh. Your choices are Freddy versus Jason, the Dream Master, the Dream Child, or Freddy's Dead. And while Reek is thinking, for those of you who don't know, Robert Shea, the producer, is the one who kind of took over the Nightmare franchise and placed himself in the majority of the movies in various roles. Has he um, you see him in one of the movies as a bartender at a uh, gay biker bar in all leather. Um, he's played various uh, random supporting characters in one-off cameo roles throughout the franchise. He's the Honestly, horror Stanley. Yes. yes. Well, specifically Nightmare Stanley. Yeah. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna say Freddy versus Jason. Okay. Does anyone else want to take a guess? Uh Tommy. Tommy and his first. You're muted. You're muted. <laughs> Give me the choices one more time. <laughs> Freddy versus Jason, the Dream Master, the Dream Child, Freddy's Dead. Uh, I'm gonna go with Freddy's Dead. That was my. That was the other guess I had. That's not right. Dream Child. The point goes to Katie. Ooh, he said he dead. said he was a background character in a gay bar. That's Freddy's Dead. No, that's Freddy's. That's Freddy's Revenge. Oh, well, whatever. I knew it was the same. <laughs> whatever. So, I knew that that happened. I told you I'm not good with the subtitles. <laughs> uh, the Dream Child is correct answer. Robert Shea played a lecture talker, uh, a lecturer talking about dreams in the Dream Master. He played a ticket seller in Freddy's Dead, and he played the mm. principal in Freddy vs. Jason. What? Yeah. You guys I'm may surprised. also recognize his sister Lynn Shea, who was in those movies, but is better known for her roles in Insidious. Oh really? We oh, talked about she was, this. And she was a teacher in the, the first one. Yes. We talked and about and a nurse in New Nightmare as well. When we covered this fucking franchise, we talked about this. I right, listen, that was how long ago? <laughs> okay. Just saying we talked about it. Mm. I, I I let Katie guess because there were still two options on the board. She had a 50-50% chance of getting it wrong. So you're saying there's a chance. All right, Tommy. <laughs> Will. <laughs> I like that no one else um, can see it <laughs> on screen. <laughs> what, what year did Alice and Dan graduate high school? Well, um, go out on a limb here and say, uh, night, nineteen ninety two. Incorrect. Reek? Uh, eighty seven. Incorrect. Damn. You want to take a guess, Katie? Um, my original guess, without like really thinking, was eighty-four. Incorrect. Seventy-six. What is it? <laughs> Incorrect. Uh, oh. Nineteen eighty-nine. So you guys were actually all kind of in the ballpark. Okay. Uh, you can see the year they graduate on the tassels attached to their caps in the graduation scene. Mm. Uh, tricky, tricky. I was confused at first. I thought he said Alice and Dan. I'm like. Wait, Alice and, and Dan. I'm yeah, sorry. yeah. <laughs> I heard Alice and Dan. I was like, "Who the fuck is Alice and yeah, Dan?" I was like, "Hold on," but then I'm like, what "Wait, Alice." Did I missed the character. You guys are from this generation. We put couples together as one name. Alice and Dan is just a person now. Well, I know. Yeah, it's a ship. That's right. Like the Titanic. All right, Katie. <laughs> Thank you. Will. Appreciate it. Uh... <sighs> Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> that sounded hesitant. <laughs> I'm so scared. <laughs> oh, that's easy. You know what? Let me not pull my hand up. 
No, see, stop. I don't. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We're going to do this for like 30 seconds and then she's going to guess it. No, it's hard to see. I'm blind. Oh, that's Candyman. That is correct. Well, wasn't even 30 seconds. <laughs> She's this big. I can't see. The painting on the wall gives it away. I've only seen that movie one and a half times. <laughs> Being John Malkovich. That is incorrect. <laughs> um, however, uh, what is correct is you guys going to patreon.com slash creation world where for $1 you get three shows. Uh, you get Return to Wrestling with Matt and Travis where we cover old school WCW. We started at the very first Nitro, and we worked our way all the way up to Road Wild 1998, where I had to sit through Diamond Dallas Page and Jay Leno versus Hulk Hogan and Eric Bischoff in the main event of a fucking pay-per-view in Sturgis. It's a thing. It's yeah. there. It's available now. Go check it out. Uh, we also have Multiverse with Travis and Morrow, where they cover DC animated films. Again, ladies and gentlemen, this $1, yes, you get the newest episodes, but there's an entire back catalog. You get everything me and Travis have done, every DC animated film that Travis and Mara have done, and all five, I think now, episodes of the third podcast, if you have to ask. If you have to ask, is an Am I the Asshole podcast featuring me and my wife, Kate. What? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Nothing happened. You can, you can watch later. <laughs> Was it Tommy? Was it? Yeah, it was Tommy. <laughs> I just wanted to make sure I didn't fuck up what I was talking about. I don't care what no. Tommy does with his fingers. No, no. Tommy, do all the things with your fingers. Um, Ew. Sir? If you have to ask, is an Am I the Asshole podcast featuring me and my wife, Kate. Katie has been a guest twice. Uh, Mara and Bridget, who was in the chat, have also been on as guests. We sit down. We read uh, Am I the Asshole posts on Reddit. And then kind of go into them, talk a little bit about our relationship. It's a good time. Uh, so go spend one dollar, check that out. Or, you know, if you guys think, hey, these guys are fucking cool and we want to give them a little more money, you can, you know, check the other tiers and see what we have to offer, including a tier ad free. However, you watching us live now, uh, need to listen to Travis tell you how to get a fairly fantastic discount on sex toys. I spice things up in the bedroom. Then it's time to check out Adam and Eve. Because you see, Adam and Eve is the leading adult toy store that offers a wide range of products to help you explore your sexual desires. Whether you're looking for something to use solo or with a partner, they have everything you need to satisfy your cravings. From vibrators to lingerie, bondage gear to lubricants, adamandeve.com has it all. And the best part, you can shop with confidence, knowing that all their products are of high quality and backed by a 100% satisfaction guarantee. That means whether you bought a dildo, sex swing, penis ring, vibrator, anal sex toy, bondage toy, couples toy, lube, or accessory, you can get a refund within 90 days if you're not 100% satisfied. No questions asked. And right now, as a special offer to our listeners, Adam and Eve is giving you 50% off almost any item on their website. That's right, 50% off. And if you act now, you'll also get free shipping. So go to adamandeve.creationworld.com and use the offer code erotica at checkout. That's erotica at adamandeve.creationworld.com for 50% off almost any item and free shipping. Don't wait. This offer won't last very long. The link is in the description. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Go and get yourself some awesome sex toys. 50% off and free shipping. You can't beat that. Uh, I'm not Enzo Amore, but I'm stealing his line. Wow. I, I guess can't teach that. Can't but for me, you can't, you can't beat that. Okay. Um, okay. I'll allow it. Uh, Tommy, uh, oh yeah, no, just, just will. There we go. All right, uh, we're on Reek. Yep. How are you guys enjoying the game so far? How's it going? Stressful. It's fun, but uh, I'm getting my ass beat. So. <laughs> well, I don't think you're lucky. As someone who better. just started movies <laughs> it's, it's a year ago, worse. right? I mean, look at what, look at how far you got since you just started watching movies. To be fair, I did tell Katie that 
I told Katie my money was on her because I have been the Yoda to her Luke, and I have been, <laughs> you know, training her along the way with this show and all of the stuff we've been doing. So I, I told her I had faith in her. Yeah, she definitely she had movies. her money on you. <laughs> as uh, yeah, always, I, I have my money she on bet you. I'm black. Look <laughs> at <Fucking> Christ. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just quoting you. That's what you say. Always bet on black. That's what, that's, that's what I that's say, it. but Jesus okay. Christ. Reek, you All got right. this one. I believe in you. Okay. What, what getting, method? Oh. What method of evicting demons from a possessed person is still widely used and practiced in many religions such as Christianity and Islam? An exorcism. That is correct. Do you want to score up, Nick? Uh, yeah. Okay. Katie, you have eight. Okay. Greek, you have six. Damn. Tommy, you also have six. <laughs> <laughs> and the chat's still setting at three. They've hung in there. So, yeah. Okay. Tommy is the sleeper dark horse in this game for some reason. Well, Tommy, let's let's see if you can surpass Reek. Wow, that's wild. <laughs> He's excited about the room. I got a shot. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I have a shot. There's still hopes. Now, mind you, Tommy, I'm I'm just pulling the top card off. So uh what is the name of the Egyptian god of the underworld that preceded Osiris? So... I only know like two or three of them. <laughs> That's all Egyptian gods in there. So we're right. Like, oh, there's Amunra, there's Horus, and there's fucking. Uh... Quit Googling it, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy, I need you to look at yes. the screen, look directly into my eyes, my, my beautiful, beautiful <laughs> eyes. I'm thinking. <laughs> <laughs> Horus. Horus is your answer? Correct. That is incorrect. Katie Eureka, you guys want to take a stab at it? Oh. Uh, you said uh, Egyptian god of the underworld? What After is the name Osiris. of the Egyptian god of the underworld that preceded Osiris? Oh. Uh. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I'm not even gonna touch that one. <laughs> I don't. I don't have a guess. The answer is Anubis. Oh, oh you gotta God. be. <sighs> the cat one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, one cat dog. Okay, dog. Well, yeah, it was dog. Dog. Okay, yeah, it was dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That dog in him. The the <laughs> long nose. <laughs> right. I don't know how to describe it. I'm trying to be as political. I don't, I don't know how to describe it. But the <laughs> long nose, correct. tall pointy ears. It, 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 it looked like a doll. That, you, okay, you can, yeah. go with that. I think we're talking about the same person. Animal thing. Jesus, I don't know. Wolf, wolf. wolf. Trivia. Just let Will decide. <laughs> yeah, let's just go general trivia. And let the general trivia? Up. Yeah. The cards are fun. <laughs> Tommy. <laughs> Tommy okay. said porn. Tommy just wants porn. <laughs> Technically, he's in the right place. <laughs> well, we're seeing as Tommy's technically in the game, I don't count him as the chat, so we're going to let Will pick in the absence of the chat, and Will said trivia. Okay. Uh, what word derived from the French for seat is used to describe a meeting of people with the purpose of communicating with spirits. Seance. That is correct. I don't speak French. 
clearly neither do I when I try to pronounce dude's name from fucking <laughs> interview with no, the vampire. I, but... I think you nailed it though. <laughs> Just saying. I really want more name that scene. Like I collected a bunch of those. I really thought that was gonna happen. That's all I've been getting now. <laughs> Freddy. Freddy. <laughs> Freddy Chance in the chat. Freddy. <laughs> Freddy. I'm here for emotional support. All, all right, right Reed. Emotional support animal. That's good. That's really good. <laughs> Emotional support will. Emotional support will. In Freddy versus Jason, what did Kia call Freddy's blades that were on his glove? <laughs> blooded knives. That is correct. Oh, what is with the blooded knives? Oh, it's Christmas sweater. Oh, that's one of the best parts of the movie. It really is, though. Coming up a you little short theory. there. <laughs> Uh, All right, Tommy. Tommy loves these. <laughs> Tommy loves the D. He loves the trivia cards. Wait, did Reed get a point? I yes, did. Reed did get a yes. point. Okay, I'm sorry. Making sure I stay caught up. <laughs> that's that's they're tight right now. Reek's ahead of Tommy by one. Katie's ahead of Reek by two. All right, <sighs> Tommy. Why, during a haunting or other paranormal activity, does a room supposedly drop in temperature? Uh, is it like um? Is it, isn't it like the, the spiritually like the orbs and shit? Doesn't uh, 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 like the fuck. I don't know, like spiritual presence, orbs, or some soul. I don't know. Why, during a haunting or other paranormal activity, does the room supposedly drop in temperature? I get it. I, that's right. I just answered oh. your question. You just said spirits or orbs or some shit. It's, it's, it isn't like the fucking, like, because of the, the, the spiritual presence or some shit. I don't fucking know, man. <laughs> You're right there. I just need a little bit more. Uh, think of uh, think of Call of Duty. What? An airstrike. Man. He said, "Think of Call of Duty." <laughs> Man, I got nothing, bro. Does anyone else want to take a stab at it? An EMP. Uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> the electromagnetic uh, pulse in the room? Incorrect. Yeah. It is because the spirit is drawing on energy in order to manifest itself. So it's oh. sucking energy out of the room and the temperature drops. Do I get half a point for that? <laughs> no. <laughs> there are no half points here. But I said you were there. I'm like, you're so close. Like, if you had said energy, if you're like, because if, if you had said spirit energy, I would have given it to you. Presence, energy, same shit. <laughs> different shit. <laughs> Real different shit. Not today, Junior. The answer is not Asia. Sorry. <laughs> I can't give you many more freebies because you're doing really well. So like if you were if you were failing as miserably as you thought you would, I, I might I might throw you a couple bones, but you're doing pretty fucking good. Oh, I'm not asking for the freebies. I'm just here. <laughs> I'm just here. Tommy's just happy to be included. What the fuck? Maybe you have to Another like change one. the position of those goddamn wheel or something. Another one. Another one. <laughs> I'm All right, Katie. Okay. What agricultural tool is the Grim Reaper famous for carrying? A, it, I, I mispronounce it every time, though. Is it a... I don't know how to pronounce it. That's the problem. 
Russian. <laughs> I know what it is. I don't know how to pronounce it. Black and French fried taters. <laughs> <laughs> Is it a scythe? That is correct. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it. The I spelling is it weird. Perfectly. You pronounced it perfectly. Yeah, no, you did a yeah, great job. I fucking thought about it. You're working with Katie. Just, just, just get off admit, my case. You're working, case. You're working the room <laughs> right now. Come get off your dick, Katie. Come get off your dick. No. All right, we're not doing that three times in a row. We're spinning again. Spinning. Thank you. Tommy said this game is horseshit. It's rigged. Ten seven six. I think it is. Uh, what the fuck? This is recently eighth time in a row getting ready. <laughs> yeah, you might just have to like retype everything in or something, man. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> we've been using to Quill like to name four that weeks, movie. and we've never had this many in a row like that. Like, I know. like that's crazy. Reek, like in the original Nightmare on Elm Street, mm -hmm. Glenn told his mom that he was at his aunt's place who lived near a what? An airport. <laughs> that is correct. With that shitty ass recording. With, with the tape. <laughs> a car crashes and some lady screaming. He's uh, like, no, no, it's fine. It's fine. There's, I don't know what's going on out there. <laughs> Tell me one's trivia. <laughs> Damn! Hold on. Is there hey, like TC's here. The, wi the, wi the wheel getting a little rigged? That is kind of lopsided. Yeah, I'm gonna. There's weight to this, right? Like this is everything has this, weight. It's it's been it's been heavy on it's one side. Button, Matt. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. There we go. Oh, Tommy, do you want all things Freddy? Or you want me to spin again? Spin the wheel. <laughs> spin the wheel, make a deal. Watch it still be the same way. Well, fuck me. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> that's crazy. Oh, uh, it's kind of just mean at this point, but also kind of funny. <laughs> what ghost is famously said to haunt the White House? Can you get rid of the wheel? What? Who is Abraham Lincoln? That is correct. They talk about it in Chucky. What? When the kids read the book, he's talking about it. Oh shit! Mm. Glass shatters and right, T-Sin walks in the room. <laughs> yeah. Or, 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 or name that movie. I'll take name that movie. <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah. Al Jack got a point for Abe Lincoln. Well, copy that. Roger Dodger. See, I said yeah. that, but I'm not. It, give me a hard one. Fuck it. A hard one? Fuck it. Okay. Katie's like, I'm so far in the lead. Apparently, there hasn't been a hard one. So far in the lead. No, I just. I just want to see if it's something I actually know. Yeah, what in the fuck? <laughs> Um, I don't know who any of these people are. The Flowers in the gun. <laughs> Incorrect, Will. <laughs> well, <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> See, TC, I think, would be good at naming this movie. Well, you got a guess, TC? Guess in the chat. Oh, man. He's the best being. He loves movies. The little girl has a crossbow and a flannel. Could be a lesbian, who knows? Doctor has like a what? gun or something. It could be a lesbian. That's a child, Katie. What's wrong with you? <laughs> she still could be. I'm just saying. Uh, I'm, just I'm here to judge. Oh, man. Uh, I'm just trying to make this interesting. Who cares? Why does he look like you have a squirt gun and she's got a crossbow? That's really lopsided. Yeah, this is this is. Yeah, I he has like a paintball gun. She's a full ass crossbow. The other dude has a gun in his pants. Female. Like, yeah. <laughs> I don't. Uh, I there don't even have skulls on the wall behind them. Oh, there's skulls. There's weird little lights. There's cobwebs everywhere. It's something probably in a cave. I'm trying to figure out who the middle is. I, I don't even have a guess, but this picture is insane. 
Really? Who? Who the fuck is that? RV Keitel? He, yeah. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I see it. I see it. No, I don't know. I don't have a guess. <laughs> is that Liam Neeson? Does anyone have <laughs> is a this guess? Taken like, three? Crazy. This is not taken three now. Stop it. <laughs> <clears throat> So oh. I'm sorry, saw three in honor What's of Vince. The kid's name from the Goonies. There's Which a lot one? of kids in the Goonies. Chunk. <laughs> Chunk. <laughs> yep, that's the one I was thinking of. Data. Yep. Chang, get the. Fuck Nobody's got a guess. No. What is this? <sighs> pussy, so pussy, pussy. It's from Dust Till Dawn. Oh, oh fuck. The the the, the squirt gun. Uh, I never realized what that kind of looked like. The squirt gun is filled with holy water. The gun in his pants are bullets that are uh, they have a cross carved into them, and she has stakes in the crossbow. Yeah. Mm. That is okay. Juliet Lewis. Um, well done. Have you seen you seen the movie Ma? No. It didn't look interesting to me, so I didn't see it. It's actually pretty good. Okay. I might give it a chance. <laughs> Is that Liam Neeson? <laughs> <laughs> Liam Neeson looks good. Chat's choice. Oh, boy. Oh, I right, want TC chat. to pick for Reek. Yeah, let TC TC, oh. your options for Reek are name that movie, horror or porn, all things Freddy or random trivia. <laughs> Look out! Look out for your boy, man. Look out for you. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. <laughs> horror horror porn. Porn. Oh man! He also called himself a terrible Quentin Tarantino fan. He's betrayed God. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Necromania. That's a porno. That is a porno. <laughs> <laughs> that definitely could be both. That puts well, you I mean, back ahead of Tommy. Oh, like if that if that's a horror movie. I'm just a hey, C C level horror movie right there. <laughs> Look at that TC was looking out for it. He knew. He had your back. I mean, a Serbian film is a horror movie technically, but it's that's a snuff film, right? Well, yeah, yeah. Tommy, <laughs> Tommy, what the fuck? Are you doing this wheel? What kind of voodoo did you put on my He's wheel? He's a witch. He's a uh, witch. He's a all witch. right, Tommy. Random trivia. In Alfred Hitchcock's horror film Psycho, who is the disturbed motel owner? You're muted, but okay. He's like, I know. <laughs> I'm just saying. Okay. I'm trying to help you out. A Serbian film is a horror. <laughs> yeah, that, that's what they categorize it as. It's clearly not that, but did this I, I have no question? idea. No, no idea. idea. No guess. Okay. Katie's hand was up first. Reek went like, oh, that's easy, and then put his hands down. And Katie was just like, no, I got Well, because I figured he'd get it. <laughs> Norman Bates. That is correct. I was thinking that ODB song. I love how like Tommy can get like all of the weird, just random horror, like actual factual shit. And then we give him a horror movie thing. And he's like, I have no idea what the fuck you guys are talking about. He's a witch. <laughs> uh, I have seen the psycho sequels. I also I watched uh, Bates Motel. I, I love Bates Motel. That was I, a great I, show. I, I will watch. I will watch Bates Motel. I wish you used to watch the sequels because I don't want the, the classic ruin for me. No, I don't like this category. All right, yeah. Katie. <sighs> Sorority babes in the slime ball bolo rama. <laughs> If that's not a porn, I'm going to have so many questions. I'm going to watch the shit out of that. <laughs> See, my guess is porn, but it's going to be a horror movie. You are correct. It is a horror movie. It's every time. Uh, what? Made by the same... 
Sorority Babes and the Slime Ball Bolo Rama is a trauma film made by the same people that made the Toxic Avenger and all the other terrible shit. Yeah, all those shitty ass fucking movies. I should have known. Wow. And is a horror movie. So no I points mean, for Katie. That's crazy. I told you. I knew. When it when it comes to horror porn, Katie, whatever you think you want to say, just say the opposite of that. Because every time you're like, it's I'm gonna say this, but it's probably that. And then you're right. The, the only second. one I've known legitimately was Deathgasm, because I've seen that on a horror movie list. That's before. not true. You knew about the Midnight Meat Train. You know all about Midnight Meat Train. Excuse you. Our post show, the Midnight Meat Train. I I'm not signing on on that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. Katie. Damn. I hate it here. Oh, not again. Not again. TC, what do you got for Reek? Oh, God damn it. Again, it is horror or porn. Name, Name that you. scene. All things Freddy or random horror trivia card. Hey, Loki, you can bring me back in this, bro. I'm trying to make a comeback right now. Tommy, what the fuck? <laughs> Horror porn horror again. Porn again. Oh, dog. <laughs> Only some Freddy. I don't know what all things Freddy is, LOL. It's just anything from uh, the Nightmare on Elm Street. It's just random trivia from Nightmare on Elm Street. All the questions are from Nightmare on Elm Street. Uh, Reek, feed me. Horror movie. Incorrect. That is a porn. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh man! Starring Ryback. Right <laughs> right <back. laughs> yes. Well, no, he's in the sequel. Feed me more. Yeah, oh, come on. Yeah, That's come on. Clever. Maggots. It's too late. You already picked horror porn. She <laughs> said, "Do Freddy then." <laughs> After the question was already answered. Here. All right, Tommy. Oof. Yeah, how does it feel? <laughs> That's bad. They suck. <laughs> oh. Three for three. You're on the run. Random trivia. All right. The chat throws something in. Well, Allison Wilson's said random, random trivia. Three. So. It's on Tubi. <laughs> it, of course it's on Tubi. No one is surprised. It, it is definitely a porn. Trust me. I looked these up specifically. <laughs> Could be both. Who knows? I guess it could be both. Danny Solstos. However, uh, the one we're talking about is Her Lust is Unleashed, A Nightmare Unfolds, an adult time film. Oh, well, there you go. Yeah. That's it. Just give him, just give him a <laughs> random one. All right. <sighs> All right, Tommy, I'm sorry. Uh, what army from beyond the grave does Jason defeat in the movie Jason and the Argonauts? Um, well, you said what, what, what army? Yeah, what army from beyond the grave does Jason defeat in the movie Jason and the Argonauts? Hmm. Beyond the grave. <laughs> I, I'm just going to go with the, the zombie army, my guy. That is incorrect. All right. Reek? Uh, zombie, uh, the, not zombie uh, the army of the dead? I, they're skeletons, I'm pretty sure. So, that like, is correct. The skeleton army. Okay. Correct. I was I was dead. I was just gonna say army of dead. <laughs> so I put my hand back down. I was like, that's not right. <laughs> so I was gonna I was gonna ask for a point total update and possibly give Reek that half point, but since he got this one right, we're just we're we're not doing half points. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> he's not getting one. Trail. I mean, he got the one he just stole from you, but he's not yeah. getting an extra point. He's not getting half. Point. Oh, I was about to say there ain't no half points here. <laughs> exactly. That's what, <laughs> That's what I just saying. said. That's what we've been saying. Okay. Uh, Katie is 10. Reek has nine. Tommy has seven. 
Tommy, your back half is not nearly as good as your front half. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's what I've been told. That's insane. That's wild. <laughs> Is it Katie's turn? No, the trivia yeah. is relentless right now. Katie, in yes, the sir. film Little Shop of Horrors, what source of nourishment does Seymour's mysterious plant require? People? I don't know. Like... That's oh, there's somebody behind you. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine if we were doing trick or trivia and Tommy just got taken out? Like, Yo. Oh my god! Listen, listen. After seeing Unfriended, I'm closing my computer immediately. Uh, yeah, no, fuck that. No, look, isn't it just look, there? It is. <laughs> it's a ghost. It's a, it's a spirit. <laughs> no, the plant. It's gonna eat him. Look, like <laughs> right beside him. People like feet. Like, what? don't give me a point. I don't care. <laughs> Go ahead, Rick. Blood? Blood. Oh, my God. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a game. Katie and Rick are tied at 10 apiece. What's in a person? I'll just go fuck myself. Whatever. I, there is blood in a person, figured, but it specifically said what is the source of nourishment. Like, you could you can't just say people. There's a lot of parts of people. It could be eating the brains. Like, zombies eat brains. Like, I need specifics. I'm sorry, Katie said, I'll just go fuck myself. Tommy looks at the camera and goes, <laughs> Tommy. <laughs> All right, we're not doing random trivia. Oh, again. My we're, shuff we're shuffling the shit again. Relentless. Matt. Yes. Your will is out of balance, Bubba. I, yeah, I got to figure that out. The out of balance wheel. There you go. Oh. All things are right in the universe. Rika Panther. Freddy oh, yeah, Freddy. of course. Rika, it's the old thing Freddy question. But listen, I haven't been that great with them. <laughs> what is the name of the character played by actor Mark Patton? Oh, oh. Uh... <laughs> That's your boy, Jesse. CC. Jesse, there we go. The Jesse is correct. Also, yes, that is Reek. Reek. Then Katie, then Jess, then me, in that order from left to right. Katie, are you okay over there? Yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> I hate this fucking game. You're winning. No, you're not. No, I'm not. Nope. <laughs> Luke is up by one point. Well, you might have a chance to steal from Tommy here. <laughs> <laughs> I like how negative you are about it at this point. Like, well, uh, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Uh, the answer is old Greg. <laughs> old Greg. The Mighty Boosh was a great show, Tommy. Thank you. I agree. Hold on a second. What's up? <laughs> okay, yeah, that's the one. Oh, okay. I can't make it bigger. Yeah, where was that that's when I'm squinting? Well, I, the one that I did for you was as big as it got. This is a bigger picture, so when I double oh, click it, it gets okay. bigger. I, I enlarge them Fair. normally. Fair. First of all, that looks like an Olympic nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> like is that, that what happens when you hang on Cody Rhodes' fuck? Oh. Oh, boy. Oh, that got that, that is not poor, Nelson. That is, that is not poor. <laughs> that got dark. <laughs> Any guesses, Tommy? I get a hint. A hint? No, it, no you can't. Is this how yeah. single one is bro his no me body. metal with a broken neck? Is that is that your guess? <laughs> no. That's okay. He's like bash backlash 05. <laughs> Jesus Christ. 
Uh, it, it is a uh, female gymnast folded on a mat. Um, there, there's dust in the air and balance beams, or right? Are those ba- uneven bars? Those, those are unevens, yes. Yes, uneven bars. I, 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 didn't answer. I got nothing. Katie? Which one is it? It's Final Destination 5. That is correct. Well played, Katie. That's a tie game. I had to stop myself from making an inappropriate joke. I was thinking three. But... Uh, three's... I, I remember I, the I show. Know, I just I, don't remember the movie. I know three. Kurt Angle's Night. We're going to do one more fun. round, and then we're going to do Final Jeopardy. No, fun. Oh, I don't do well on the final, final and, ones. And final Will Jeopardy. is very key to Final Jeopardy, and he doesn't even know it yet. Oh, oh boy. God. Because Will is the only one who knows the answer to the Final Jeopardy. I don't even know the answer. What the fuck? Oh, my God. <sighs> okay, I don't Katie. Even know what in he's 19... talking about. He doesn't. In 1960, or which 1968 film is often credited with first raising the popularity of zombies? Oh, Katie. Night of the Living Dead. That's that's a layup. (laughs) Katie, that gets you one point ahead. So if Reed gets this right, you guys will be tied going into Final Jeopardy. Hear me out as my advocate. Can you not get it right? (laughs) Why would I do that? Please. And Ooh, for any question, fair. Damn it! Why did you trust him with such an important task? <laughs> <laughs> wow, well, crazy. She has no faith in you. None. Okay. Um, I will accept because they give the actor as the answer. I will accept the actor or the actor, the, uh, the actor. actor or the character. Reek. Um, okay. After Freddy killed me, a whole bunch of blood burst out of my bed. Who am I? Oh, Johnny Depp. Uh, Glenn. That's correct. That is, there you go. Yes. Well done. That is correct. Is both. Yeah. All right, Tommy. Here's your chance. If you answer on this one correct five times, you'll tie. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, Tommy did a lot better than we thought he was going to. And I think, listen, Tommy, I believe in you. Horror porn. Both Midwest, Midwest thing. <clears throat> All right, Tommy. <clears throat> Porno. <laughs> no way. Put the wheel down. No, you, 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 you Is that for real? The fucking it question? It's like... <laughs> Horror or porn, the movie is. Porno. No. Sorry. <laughs> no actual way. This is real. Real. I'm gonna go with the horror film. That is correct. And it's what? fucking great, dude. If you haven't seen it, it's hilarious from beginning to end. Did you watch you it when I put it on the list, or had yes. you seen it already? Yes, I I put that on the list for Will. Is there a synopsis for this film? Because like... they okay. So the way it works is it's a group of kids who are. They work at a movie theater, okay? At the end Uh of the shift, they all pick one movie to watch as a group after they clean up everything, right? This Mm -hmm. night, the owner of the theater leaves, and they find themselves in a group of shenanigans where they they get into this back room of the theater, and they play this movie that's a a porno, ultimately, for their group movie. But they're this hyper-Christian group of conservative kids, and they watch Uh this porno... And the lady like fucks them to kill them. It unleashes what? a demon. <laughs> yeah, a it unleashes demon. a demon that then goes on a killing spree through sex. Yeah, um, to take their souls. Oh, that's no crazy. shit. Bruh. Like it's a fucking. I at first I was highly skeptical. I was like, this is gonna be some B list shit, and it was legitimately okay. a good watch. If you like, if you want for. Go ahead, Matt. Sorry. If, if you want the official synopsis, it is a 2019 horror movie, porno, when five teen employees at the local movie theater in a small Christian town discover a mysterious old film hidden in the basement, they unleash an alluring succubus who gives them sec- a sex education written in blood. Ew. Mm. Damn. Okay. Jesus Christ. I've heard it all now. <laughs> 
And with that, it is final oh. jeopardy. No. Okay. No. <laughs> uh, I'm uh, okay. So um, the question is, what is the Will Gray's favorite horror movie? You said you don't even know the answer? I do not know the answer. Will has the key to Final Jeopardy. Holy shit. I've said it on the air multiple times. I've talked about it because I said it's my favorite series of a specific type of horror movie. And I've, I've petitioned for getting off to do a, a group of movies, like to do this series specifically. Oh, man. Oh man. I'm trying to think of that fucking list I had to write down. <sighs> uh real oh, quick before be while you guys are deciding, I need you guys to tell me uh or at least if you can if you have paper, you can either verbally say it or write it down how many points you wish to wager. Uh will please remind them each how many points they each have. Katie 12, Reek 12, Tommy 7. We we are tied. Oh shit. <laughs> Do you want me to give you guys the hint? Can Please. I give them a hint? You can give them a hint because they all seem very stumped. Okay. The genre of movie. All right. Zombies. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. I know it. 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 Which one? Genre, period. Which so one? He, here's why I picked this. Because as... Members of the President show. Evil. President Evil. Well, hold on. <laughs> as, as members of the show, that's your official guest, Reek. And Tommy, who watches the show every week, Will has said it on air. I know he has. So Reek wagered two points, and his answer was Resident Evil. Tommy, how many points are you wagering? All of them. All of them? <laughs> and what is your guess? I'm going to go to Resident Evil. You're going to go Resident Evil? Katie, how many points did you wager? All of them. All of them? And your guess? 28 days later. Will? Katie gets the win. Let's fucking go. Oh, shit. You went the wrong direction. I tried to no-sell it for you because I was like, dude, he's so fucking close. Because but I was into the Resident Evil. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sitting up there like I'm like, oh wait a minute, because res 28 days later it was like right at the back of my mind, but I'm like, mm -hmm. but then just, I'm like, wait. just so nobody knows I'm lying, it is written no, down. I, I, oh. So night, again, me, my the night me, Matt, and Katie sat here and we went over and we made the whole list that included trivia. I was like, I, I want to do a 28 it. days and 28 weeks later like episode where we talk about that those two movies. Because Danny Boyle's recording the third one now. To be fair, that's true. I knew his that favorite genre was zombie, but I wasn't a hundred percent sure on his favorite movie. So I knew he had said it, but I didn't remember exactly which one it was, which is why I wanted yep. to use this. Because again, if you guys are watching the show, or like I said, Tommy's here every week watching and paying attention, or you are participating in the show. <laughs> It was an answer that was given out in a previous episode that everyone had a chance to know. So what on this plane, list, man. on this list, I don't even have 28 Days Later written. And this was in the bottom of my basket. I couldn't even see. It says zombie, but I distinctly remember Will talking about how he loves. I'm not going to go back to my he loves 28 Days Later. And he's very <laughs> the one where Sandra Bullock goes to rehab. <laughs> <laughs> 28 Days? 28 Days Later? <laughs> no, I was all saying. I distinctly remember Will saying he loved 28 Days Later because he mm -hmm. wanted to cover it on the show. Katie, you are the first winner of <laughs> Trick or Trivia. Um, I've decided. I think we're going to do a few of these throughout the year. Um, and I'm going to try and get Four winners to bring back for the last episode of the year. The last episode will be Trick or Trivia, and we'll do an elimination style. Uh... That's final score. 
<laughs> we'll do an elimination style trivia to determine the trick or trivia champion at the end of 2024. Al's got to do Banna next time because there's no way I'm not playing. <laughs> <laughs> I am also taking the random horse because I have a hundred of them. The ones we've already used are getting put away. They are not going to be in rotation for next time. They will be out. Uh, there will be a whole new setup of horror or porn. I still have a bunch of pictures I didn't get to use. And we will be re replacing all things Freddy with all things whatever other horror franchise I decide to choose uh, going into the next, next trivia. So uh allison or katie or both can be my vanna because katie will not be able to play next round because she's already advanced so you guys like this though this was fun you guys had a good time i had a blast i'm sweating <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. all right i got zero points <laughs> but you didn't tommy you actually did really well like for someone who has come on the show and he's like I'm here hanging out. I don't know any of these movies. I haven't seen them. I don't watch horror movies. You showed up and you had, he went in with what, five or six points? He had seven finals? going into it. Seven. 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 sleeper picks were the ones that weren't horror movie related. It was just general, like, it was random yeah, knowledge. like, other than Robert England and Brad Pitt, like, <laughs> <laughs> he rocked the horror, like, the general trivia stuff. So, I got to plan this out. I, if I do it in quarters, we'll only have... Maybe I'll do four this year. Maybe we'll do four horror trivias, one each quarter, because this is March at the end of March. So we'll do one in June. Okay. We'll do one in September. And one okay. in, in our final one in December. And we'll get okay. the three champions, the three winners, to face off to determine the champion in December. I think that's what we'll do. That was but, I want to thank you guys for watching. Yes, Tommy. Uh, may I be involved in all of these just to see if I could win? Absolutely. <laughs> uh, Captain Birdseye, Hector, Captain Birdseye says, you look like a fine specimen of a man and wants to know uh, if you're single and ready to mingle. The, the shaggy uh, nope. picture is wild. No, I'm not. <laughs> Captain Birdseye, please tell me that's your dad. <laughs> <laughs> all right thank you guys for joining us katie congratulations on winning the first episode of trick or trivia will thank you for being my vanna and the key to victory without knowing you were the key to victory thanks will reek and tommy i, I mean reek you were tied with katie you came back you you held your own we already talked about how awesome Tommy did with not knowing a single thing about horror movies. Like I was trying to pull a Trish Williams and I got shut down. Mellow, don't miss, baby. <laughs> Katie, he will please tell everyone <laughs> where they can find you before we get into our midnight meat train. Please don't call it that. <laughs> it's already official. Please. Oh man. Uh, but you know, you can follow me on Twitter at Katie Rasen13, link to your to Gal Things Sheila Showcase, twitch.tv slash Sheila Showcase, youtube.com slash Sheila Showcase, typically Thursday, 6 p.m. Eastern ish. We're going to try and do a show this Thursday. To be determined, I will try. I'm not making any promises. Uh, if I can't get it to work, I'm saying fuck it and I'm not doing a show. Um, yeah, just everything's on the channel. I'll be, I'll be in Philly. I actually leave today. But I'm staying with a friend for a few days, and then I'll be in Philly for all things WrestleMania. Okay, Reek. That was a lot. Yeah, y'all <laughs> yeah. uh, can find me at Reek Hanford24 on Instagram and on Twitter. You can find the Havoc Hour, Sports Talk Sports Entertainment Media, on all streaming platforms: Anchor, X, Spotify, Google Podcasts. The video version is up on YouTube, and you can find Young Kings Wrestling on all things at YK Wrestling. At yk.wrestling.com, links to all the platforms, the merch, the uh, podcast, and everything is on there. Tommy, uh, you can find me uh, here in the chat every every day. 
Um, <laughs> you, you have a podcast, Tommy, that you could plug and tell everyone. Yeah, I, I am. I'm getting, I'm getting there. Okay. Okay. <laughs> um, you can find me on Instagram. I'm not Tommy1422. That's where I do most of my uh, talking to people. Um, starting this week, this week I will be back for the after party with DJ Tommy. But we talk about music, nightlife, and all other good shit. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Will? First and foremost, Mateo, I want to say thank you for allowing me to be the honorary use of all things creation world. If you want to find my shenanigans elsewhere, you can check my OnlyFans at Chef Will Gray. There you go. And as always, you guys can <laughs> Damn, follow was- me on Twitter at Matt Ritter, that's at M-A-T-T-R-I-D-D-E-R, or at Getting Off, Getting Off for your horror content. Matt Ritter for your wrestling content and at Smackin' It Raw everywhere else, threads, Blue Sky, TikTok, and Instagram. And you'll get a little bit of both there as well. Uh, for the Will Gray, our champion of tonight, Miss Katie Kinsey Bay Bay, Dr. Reek Baker, BBC. And we're gonna we're gonna call him Tommy today because he did pretty well. Not Timmy, he was Tommy. I am the patron saint of podcasting, the warden Matt Ritter. This has been your number one horror podcast on places where you can find people having sex on the internet.